Hi again. We're still looking at exponentials and trying to solve them. And well, this one looks trickier already. What do we have? 5 to the x equals 11. And we've been saying if we can put them to the same base, the exponents must be the same. But there's no way to relate 11 and 5. At least not without some really weird fractional exponent that we're not going to figure out too easily. So we're going to look at another way of solving it. We've been looking at logarithm rules and the power rule in particular. Well, that's the trick we're going to use here. We're going to take the log or ln of both sides. Remember, ln is just log to the base e. Often we use ln because it's on your calculator. You'd all use, so use log to the base 10 because that's also on most calculators. There is some of the newer ones that have log to the base anything you can enter it. But if you have at all an order calculator, often you're going to use something like ln. So what, what do I mean? Well, let's say I take ln of both sides. Remember, as long as I'm doing it to both sides, I'm allowed. I can do that. No big deal at all. Because it's the same thing done to both sides. Great. So why did this help me? Well, remember my power rule. I can rewrite this as x ln 5, all equal to ln 11. Well, this is just the same kind of math we've been doing. Now I have something multiplied by x. How do I get rid of it? Divide both sides by ln of 5. Ooh, and I should write that as 11. These cancel, and I get x equals ln Oops. Lawn 11 all over lawn 5. And the thing is, you'd punch these in your calculator and figure it out. You'd find your answer just by going lawn of 11 in your calculator, punch it in. I, I don't know what that is off the top of my head. You punch it in your calculator, find out, divide that by lawn 5. And this would be the same as if I used log. If I used log to the base 10, which again, I can rewrite as just log, I can do the same exact problem with log or any ex base that I wanted. So I've actually jumped the step. I'm writing log of 5x equals log 11. Well, same thing. x gets brought down in front. The same exact rules still apply. And doing the same cancellation, I get the same basic idea, except with logarithms. And these two should give the exact same answers. If I use log to the base 4, I get the same answer. It just might be that my calculator couldn't calculate it for me. So I can leave it written as this or figure out the actual numerical answer and I'd be done my problem.